This is lead for oxide. Lead for because it is PBO2. So it's called lead for. Huh? Hello? <laughs> okay. Lead for oxide. So we have lead for oxide. So what we're going to do is we are going to take a bit of lead for oxide and we're going to heat this, okay? We're going to heat this. Uh, we might not have time to show you all the preparation uh, because we need to do some calculations. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to heat this using a flame. Hello? Ah. Uh, Uh, yes, there is. There is gas. Uh, so there is this gas here. So I'm going to hit this. I'm going to hit this. And you find that it will melt. It will melt. It's not focused, huh? Let's focus this. Uh, let's focus this. Okay. Is it focused? Is it focused? Yeah. Mm, let's focus, okay. Now, Let's see. Eh? So what we are going to do is, in a moment, we are going to test, as it melts, eh? we are going to test the oxygen that's going to come out from there. Can you see that it is about to melt? Sometimes it's very difficult if I don't have a videographer with me. Uh, cannot afford one. Uh. So I videograph myself and at the same time commenting on it. So it is done without a script. Okay. So now you can see that it's going to melt. Can you see it melting? Is it melting? Yeah, okay, we'll, we'll make it melt, okay? Quickly melt, are you? Achu, achu. All right, as it melts, oxygen will be produced, and the test for oxygen is the relighting of a glowing splint. Now melt, melt. Now there's a reason why I only hit one side of the lead for oxide uh, because the black powder will turn into two colors. Alright, it is, it is actually melting now and 
and I now want to test by using a glowing splint. If I use this glowing splint, this is a lighted splint. And if I use a glowing splint, can you see that this glowing splint will burst into flame? Wow! Yes, no? Yeah. And if we let this settle down, if we let this settle down, you will find that there will be two colors from the black lead for oxide. There will be two colors. And the two colors will be something like this. No, it is brown and brown and or yellow and red. Can you see the red there? Can you see the red there? Is there red? Okay, let's do the automatic one. Can you see the red? Yeah. Yeah. So the black, the black color, actually the black four oxide has turned into two other compounds. One is orange and the other is yellow. And we have to know what are these orange and yellow. Uh, can you see it's, it's orange? One orange and the orange is nearer to the black, is it not? There is a reason why that the orange is nearer to the red. Yeah. And the orange, the formula is PB3O4 while, while the yellow is PBO. Huh? The yellow is PBO. Alright, enough for that.